Hey everyone. Well, I was cleaning our room in here last night and I finally found again my Franklin Covey Planner. I used to use this quite a bit. Um, I use it a lot in real estate to keep up with my clients and their progress. Um, and I kind of got away from it last year because um, another man that I was working with, we had to sync our schedules. So we did everything over Outlook calendars. And that worked well for that position, but for real estate, it really doesn't work well for me because I can't see everything all at once and it's on the computer and there's just something about paper with certain things that I just equate to better. So I was really happy to find my trusty handy dandy Franklin Covey again. It's a really great binder. It has the zipper pouch on the front and then on the inside it has all these card holders. It has a nice big pocket here as well as a gusseted pocket and another zipper pouch. So I love all the storage in this and then also in the back it has one of those areas for the notepad to hold as well as the pen. So I already had these four right here. Those have been in here for years. Um, but I found these today at Staples because I saw a lot of people using these on their planner pages when I was watching YouTube videos last night. I've been looking for the perfect calendar to coordinate with Project Life. Um, and I had gone online to Franklin Covey's website last night for a couple hours and I just could not find what I was looking for. The way those pages are laid out, it's either too small, like little calendar dates, or it was too big, like two pages for one day. My life is busy, but it's not that busy. So, and it makes the planner weigh a ton. Um, so I was watching a YouTube video last night and she showed some by Daytimer. And Daytimer size four fits the Franklin Covey Classic. The, the holes are exact. So that's what I went and purchased today. They have this set by Flavia. And it comes in these great colors. That's what I loved about it. I'm not too huge on their quotes. The quotes are, huh, okay. But I love the colors. And it just feels like I'm flipping through a scrapbook. So I love it. But the best part is, first of all, they have the month right here which I love because I always need like a month at a glance. But then when you go into the actual weeks, like this one is, um, let me see here. This one's not a good example. They don't do it on all of them, but on most of them they do. Here we go. So like right here for January, starting on Monday, January the 7th, it's the second week. And it does that through the entire planner. So I know if it's week two, week three, week four, week five on my project life because it has it clearly labeled for me with the dates. The other nice thing is the format that I chose for project life is Monday through Sunday. So this works perfectly for my project life. I have the whole week right here so I can use those little sticky notes or washi tape and make notations of whether I took a photo for that day or just what we did for that day. And I can write those down and I have everything prepped and sketched out for my project life right there. And also my real life as far as my work appointments and everything fit here as well. So this is just perfect. I was really excited to get this for project life. Let me show you a couple of the other pages. Isn't that cute? Here's another one. And all there's just really fun colors. So I was like, this is just perfect for me. And then it also has a notes page so I can make additional notes in the month in the beginning or in the end. And just the colors, they're just so bold and beautiful and fun. I'm going to love using this. So I just wanna give you a tip if you're trying to figure out a way to organize your project life for your Monday, through your Sunday in one glance, as well as figuring out what week you are in, these things work perfect. Now, if it has a holiday, it doesn't put it right there, but see the very next week it shows it. So like the week of July 8th is gonna be the 28th week. So I'm loving this. It also came with some little calendars 
and I figured these would be perfect for me to cut out. They have holidays on the back side of it, which I don't need at all because my kid's school calendar already tells me when they're off and when they're not. So um, I can cut out these cute little calendars as well and stick those in my project life. So I just wanted to share that with you. Again, that's from Daytimer. If you're looking for the perfect little layout. Oh, there was another one I wanted to show you before my battery runs out. Look at the bicycle. Isn't that cute? Okay, so um, that's what I'm going to be using to plan out my project life from week to week. I won't always do a week to week, but when I do, this will be what I'll be working off of. Thanks for watching.